Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you about the speed and strength hammer down gloves available at Revzilla.com. So the speed and strength hammer down gloves are going to be new for 2016. This is going to be a lightweight glove. Now speed and strength is really going to be marking this for more of a lightweight summer use street glove. I can really see a dual functionality with this. I could see this as a nice beefy dirt bike glove for you guys looking for something a little bit stronger than a typical dirt bike glove to get in the dirt. And you do have that full goat skin palm. Really nice touch with something like the hammer downs. Now, as far as sizing is concerned, this is definitely going to be an American cut. I'm going to be an extra large in the hammer downs, the same way I would be with a glove from Climb or from Icon. Now, sizes are going to range from a small to a 2XL, and there is a ladies version as well. It is going to be called the Backlash in Speed and Strength's lineup. So if you see the Backlash, that is going to be the female version of the hammer down, a little bit slimmer in its cut, tailored more for the female hand. Now, as far as colorways are concerned, there's five different colors available. I am wearing the black with the red accents. Now, Speed and Strength is a brand that we know and love here at Revzilla, and they don't really fine tune themselves to just one genre of motorcycles. We see them doing street stuff. We see them doing sport bikes, cruisers. And now with something like this, I could see this as a push into the world of dirt as well. Around $35, the hammer down is going to be a nice solid option. And again, you are getting that full goat skin palm with this. If you do want to bump up to something that's going to give you a little bit more protection, consider taking a look at the Power and the Glory gloves. That's going to give you reinforcements on the palm, and you're also going to get beefed up hard knuckle protection on the back versus the TPR that you're going to see with something like the Hammer Down. Now, when we're talking about construction, like I said, that full goat skin palm is really going to steal the show. And when we start with the back of the hand and we're going to work our way through this, you're going to see single wrist closure on this, a little bit of lycra, just kind of working that through to hold everything together nicely as it to be a really nice feel to this overall piece. And then when you're working your way through the back of the hand, again, really nice polyester design, going to help the flow air, a little bit of accordion stretch at the back to help the flexibility of your knuckles as you're working with that TPR knuckle there. Again, not going to be a huge amount of, of flexibility the way you'd get with a split knuckle design, but really for the lightweight nature of the glove, the accordion stretch does a really nice job. Now, as you work your way down through the back of the fingers, you can see a little bit of that reinforcement from the TPR carrying down. And then it's really going to be the goat skin working its way over on the index finger that's going to set that apart. Now, as you look at the inner, the inner foreshets here, you are going to have a little bit of Clarino mixed with the Lycra, and that's going to add comfort as well as, again, that mobility and that flexibility. As we take a look at that overall palm, again, full goat skin design, you are going to have light perforation in the fingers, double stitching right along the base of the fingers, and you are going to have a nice speed and strength logo with a little bit of elastication right at the base of the hands. Now, if I had a small nitpick for this, I would have liked to have seen just a little bit of a beefed up reinforcement somewhere on the pinky, but again, you can take a step up to a higher level glove to work yourself into that. Now, when you wrap out at the very base of the glove, you are going to have a snap closure. And this allows you, if you are out there using this as a dirt bike style glove, or even when you're throwing it in your helmet at the end of the day, you can snap your gloves together so you don't end up dropping one of the gloves and losing them. Just a nice little finishing touch. And when you're pulling the gloves on, it works as a nice little grab point for the overall gloves. Now, again, there's a lot of riders out there that are rocking speed and strength gloves. If you want to hear more about what they have to say, click the info button. Read what other Speed and Strength Gloves riders are rocking for their rides. And if you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone. Give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Speed and Strength Hammer Down Gloves. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.